supposed to be my oh condition when I was your age. <laughs> I um, I want to tell you how I learned to read. Now, I I as I tell this story, believe me, it was made up before I learned that the magic word was Batman. All right, all right. I read comic books. Yeah. That's how I learned to read. I read Superman and learned about invulnerable. <laughs> Under the city in Gotham was the home of Captain Marvel. If you wanted to see Captain Marvel appear, you had to say, Shazam! And a bolt of lightning came and they turned this kind of wobbly guy like me into a superhero. And yes, in a cave underneath the Wayne Mansion was Robin and Batman! You know, poetry is guided by a muse. But the muse, you don't choose your own muse, your muse chooses you. And my muse this week is poetry. Next week it might be something else. <laughs> but I'm so pleased to have this opportunity to talk to you. Now my family member is Lakota Fire Thunder. <laughs> Lakota also has my second favorite Indian name. And I'm guessing that most of you do not know my first choice which is Wilma Mankiller. <laughs> Wilma Mankiller was president of the Cherokee Nation for 10 years. <laughs> While she was president, I don't know if she killed anybody or not. But then I don't know if Lakota started any fires. <laughs> Thank you. Give it up for Randy, ladies and gentlemen.